This is Birmingham. Birmingham is the second largest city in the UK and 26% of the people living here are of South Asian origin. I've come to Birmingham to see how the city is gearing up for the Commonwealth Games that kickstart on Thursday. And what better place to begin my journey than this? This is the Alexander Stadium. Built in 1976, it is the main venue for the 2022 Commonwealth Games where both the opening and the closing ceremonies will take place. Athletes will also compete in track and field events at the stadium which has recently undergone a £72 million revamp. Around 6,500 athletes from 72 nations and territories will be taking part in this year's Commonwealth Games. And some of the other venues that will be hosting this multi-sport event include the famous Edgebaston Cricket Stadium, Victoria Square, Sutton Park, Sandwell Aquatic Centre, University of Birmingham and the Coventry Stadium and Arena. The last time the Commonwealth Games were held in the UK was in 2002 in Manchester and in 2014 in Glasgow and so there's a lot of buzz and excitement here in the UK around the Games. I think it's amazing, uh, members of my family, they're so much interested in uh, sports like hockey, swimming, so I'm sure we'll, we'll take a chance and uh, go there and watch these sports. I think it's nice, it's great, yeah. I think. The roadworks are a bit annoying, but the fact that the whole world is going to be looking at Birmingham is quite nice. I've got tickets to a few games, so I'm excited to go see them. It's exciting. Obviously, it brings in a lot of jobs for other people, um, brings in a lot of different people and gives me something to do. The country is actually taking the game very seriously and also putting in hard efforts for, you know, international travellers to come and visit the game. Of course, I am supporting India being an Indian, but uh, I also support all the other players who are coming, travelling far from their countries. It's a beautiful platform for all the Commonwealth players to come in and showcase themselves. And the city looks excited and all geared up for the Games. Now regardless of which team wins, one thing is for certain, and that is that both the UK and Birmingham are all set to showcase the best of global Britain to the rest of the world and deliver an unforgettable Commonwealth Games. Gagan Sabrawal, BBC News, Birmingham.